episode of Crazy Craft, and today's these next like three episodes are gonna or two episodes, three episodes. I think three episodes are gonna be kind of a little weird because here, let me explain the whole story. First of all, you know sometimes like uh when I transfer the files, I've talked about this before. It'll like say that it's gonna the the video like turns into three days long. Well, that happened with the original episode ten. So I had to completely delete that. And then I record episode 11 and I went to go edit it and I thought that it hadn't recorded properly, but it did. I found the right file. It was just that I didn't have the right file. So this is episode 10 that you're watching right now. If anything that I, I'm going to try to edit it so that it seems normal, but it's just going to be like a clip. Okay. So if these episodes seem weird, it's because they're recorded a little weird. So enjoy the video. Roll the clip. I added three people this episode just because it was so far ahead. So this one, this guy right here is Tigu. I'm sorry if I said your name wrong. Tigao. I don't really know. Um, he said to build a room under the bunny spawner just for fighting fighting mobs and stuff and i think i'm going to do something i i'm not really sure where i'm going to build it at but it's going to be that direction and it's probably just going to be a bunch of chests for mob drops and stuff i don't really know what's going to be in the actual room but it's going to drop down probably with a actually it doesn't even need a ladder because i have a cloud pet but it's going to drop down probably all the way to bedrock level. And I need to check if obsidian is breakable by mobs or not. Because I know that like some, some servers it is. But that's because they have a plugin that makes it break. So that's going to be something I'll probably work on. Between episodes we'll be building the next room. I don't know. Actually I, I could just actually just like build it right here. I don't know because that would take up a hallway space. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do it yet but I will build a room for fighting mobs because like that uh, that was it an emperor scorpion was really annoying. And then this girl right here it's so cute. Her, her name is Candy Spose 2005 and I forget what you commented but you've been commenting a lot of things with your IG and them and I felt so bad for you because it's like I see your comments it's just I've already pre-recorded them. I just accidentally summoned Siri. No I don't no, Siri, shut up. Okay, I won't read it. <laughs> oh, Siri, I don't know if you could heard that or not, but it just picked up shut up. So there is you and I love your eyes. They're so pretty in your little Christmas skin. Maybe I'll make myself a Christmas sweater like that. I see you have that same kind of style of sweater. It's so cute. And then this girl right here, which is LOL Maddie. I love your skin. It's all pastel -y. She said to open up Pandora's boxes. So... The first thing I did was I got this, I don't know where I put it, this ultimate fishing rod and I went to the nether and you're supposed to be able to catch uh, a fire eel, I don't know what it's called, this lava eel, you're supposed to be able to catch it in the nether and then you can make helmets and stuff, I don't know, it was on the ore spawn wiki of things to do. But it didn't really work. I waited for a really long time and I never caught anything. So I don't really know. Oh, and I also saw a Pac-Man in the Nether, which reminded me that I wanted to get a Soul Shard and find some Pac-Man so I could get a Pac-Man spawner because they drop. Uh, sometimes they drop. I know they drop a lot of random stuff, but sometimes they just drop like, a, I think it was like this stuff right here, like a secret weighted plate. And a bunch of lamps. But they also drop a lot of witchery stuff. Which is really cool. What is a creeper launcher? I'll do that later. Let me put this back. And then after I went to the nether and saw the Pac-Man. And discovered that this didn't really work at all. I came back here and I used two zookeeper shards on two Easter bunnies. Because it's supposed to make them never despawn. And these guys have never despawned and literally, well, like these two chests were already filled before because I spawned 64 bunnies and just let them go. But I'm pretty sure all of these hoppers in here, yeah, every single hopper in here is backed up. So actually what I kind of want to do right now is make them go to this hopper. Yeah, I'll do that. Here we just have to move this one. 
and then there we go and then I can put these ones in here there we go and then that one is already probably quite full yes it is so that'll stop being all backed up I'm probably not gonna spawn the bunnies anymore because obviously I already have at least one of every type of egg that you could have it's just like funny how many eggs I have so after that I uh, gave my pet dragon which actually my pet dragon the baby that I spawned it grew up and then I went adventuring with it and then I did slash kill I went that direction and it like didn't come back so like I think it'll only follow you like if you it won't teleport to you so I don't really care so I just uh spawned I thought that was it I spawned another one which I'm not quite sure where he is here he is and I gave him a snowball and he turned white and red he's like an albino dragon it's so cute and you can give these guys coal to turn them back too but I like him being white I don't know if it like changes his abilities or anything I thought that he was gonna spit fire at me but he didn't oh another thing that I did that I forgot to write down I put soul stealer 5 on my big Bertha it cost so much energy or er, it was like literally like uh I think it was like 20 experience to put soul stealer 5 on here but I did it anyways here I have another egg in here I don't really want it and then after I did the white dragon I went on an inventory pet hunt which I didn't really mean to but I kept finding tree pets oh that was because I f I got this uh chainsaw and here I'll go use it on some of those birch trees out there but I found a whole lot of pets like guys look at this banana pet look at him go look at him go it's so funny and uh I got a brewing table pet I got two of these actually Oh, I think they're hungry right now. They're not going to make anything. But they just give you a random potion, which is pretty cool. Uh, let me put you up there. I got some Ocelot pets. I got a Blaze pet. Got a Oh, I got this Moon pet while I was exploring, like, a long time ago. I don't know. Reverses gravity of mobs and drops. How do... <gasps> oh my gosh, look, the bunnies are floating. That's so funny. Oh, but now they're okay I don't know what that sound is and I also found another cloud pet which is pretty cool I'm actually gonna put him in here just so I don't lose him uh I don't remember if I found I think I did find him when I was recording and then what did I do next oh next I just oh random dog appeared I just opened up some Pandora's boxes so I guess I'll do that right now. Here, let me go craft some of them. And this was requested from LOL Maddie, the, the pastel skin. Oh my god, that dragon is so annoying. I wish I could kill him, but you can't hit him. I think it's like that so that you can't accidentally hit him when you're battling, but I would really like to kill him. Uh, what am I looking for? Pandora's boxes so it's like these oh wait here we go and then I guess we're only gonna be able to make 16 but that's okay because they're kind of they don't stack and they kind of take a while oh that's a lot okay well I'm gonna fly over to where I was when I was opening them so you can see what I got before oh and also my boyfriend is out here now I don't know how we got out here because he's holding a diamond in his hand so he's not supposed to be able to walk but he keeps moving it's weird I don't really know how to get him home I can't hit him either I think that's that thing again where like so you don't accidentally hit him but so yeah he's here okay well I'm gonna fly over to where I was opening Pandora's boxes oh Another thing that I did, I opened up these, uh, survival huts. I don't know what they're called. What are they? An instant survival shelter. And I'll show you what is inside of them. There's actually, this would have been really helpful when I first started out. So it has a crafting table, a furnace, and a, whole, a little chest. I think all the chests have the same thing. But it's like really basic stuff, but it's really helpful for when you're first starting out. That would have been great. Oh, and I also opened a instant garden. I don't know what it was called. Instant 
one of these, which I was going to open a couple episodes ago, but then I got distracted by something. So that's what they look like. There's like melons and I think that's corn and radishes. I think it's actually harvest. This is corn, right? Like all of these things say that they're sugar cane when they're actually something else. Uh, what is leaf monster? What is a leaf monster? Okay, I don't like tomatoes. Uh, I think I know what this leaf monster is. I think my brother. Yes, oh my gosh, these things are so creepy looking. I ran into them when I was exploring. See, like, when they're not attacking you, they just, like, sit there like that. But when they come to attack you, they, like, wobble all around. It's so funny. Oh, and I also built a, uh, uh, waterfall. I just felt like this little, because it's like sticking out over here and it's on over here. I just needed something a little special. And it's got a little stream going down into here. It's pretty cute. Uh, those survival huts, by the way, are like the same as those. But those had ghost spawners in them. So, yeah. Like, they have like the same stuff in them too. So, I think that was pretty much it that I did last episode besides the Pandora's boxes. I'm trying to remember what else I did. Oh, I hope I did. I used the chainsaw. I went on like a little kind of a pet hunt, but I didn't really mean to. It just kind of happened because, oh my God, this thing. Because I had a chainsaw and I was just like flying around and I kept finding chests. So I kept opening them and look, there's one right here. Oh, a bed pet. Here, let me uh put all my... Pandora's actually I'm gonna put everything besides the Pandora's boxes. Oh, I wanted to see what that did too. Put uh this stuff in here. I want you E. There we go. Let me sort these because they're just like everywhere. Yeah, okay. So I guess we could go on like a little Oh a hobgoblin. Oh wait, did I literally just get the hobgoblin morph? I've killed like ton of those things when I've been exploring. Why did I just get the morph? Is that a chest right there? No. Um, these tree chests? See, I already opened that one. I think this is kind of the general area that I had been going. Um, I also want to set a beaver free in a forest just to see how many chests it could find. Here's one. Right oh wait, why is it like it's like extra buried. Oh, a sheep pet. Oh, what does this creeper launcher do? Let's do this right now. What does it do? Nothing. Okay, it does nothing. That is very helpful. I'm so glad I have one of those. Um, how many how many pets are we going to find? We don't really know. What is this? Orange leaves? Oh. <gasps> Oranges! What is this one? Are those oranges too? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna plant an orange tree, guys! Oh my gosh, we have an orange tree in my house that we got from Florida. It's it's eight years old. We got it right before my brother was born. I just remembered that. That's so cool. I'm gonna plant a little orange tree. Although I'm sure it probably grows faster in the game than they do in real life because ours is still really tiny there's actually i'm gonna use this bed where'd my bed pack go oh i didn't mean to open you oh no oh no oh no it's just fireworks okay it's not bad actually wait actually where did the bed pack go i swear i just found a bed pet didn't i oh well the the darkness never bothered me here's one on a little island these are so easy to find these are like I don't think they spawn in this biome, actually. I'm not really sure. I don't think these are the right types of trees for them to spawn in. So, I think we're getting close to where I opened the Pandora's boxes, though. So, that's good. I, I think they only spawn in, like, those littler trees down there. Which are kind of hard to see from up here. So... Wait, how big is this forest? I don't remember seeing... Oh, wait, wait, hold on. I don't know where I went. No, that's not where I went. Oh, also, when I went exploring, like, between episodes, 
I went, I just kept going straight. I went so far. Like, that's as far as I went. It was really far. And then I ran. This is, my dragon's probably like, he's probably like right here. I probably, I'll have to find a way to come rescue him. Because I think at that point I ran out of quartz. I need to start remembering to bring like mass amounts of quartz because I always forget it. I don't, I don't know where I was opening the Pandora's boxes before. It should have come up on the map. Unless, wait, where am I right now? Right here? I thought... Was it this way? I have absolutely no clue where I was. I, th I thought I remembered it being by this type of a biome, but this wasn't this big. So I guess I'll just have to open some new ones. I didn't really get anything useful out of it. Actually, I got like literally nothing uh i just like spawned a bunch of cool stuff sometimes it like didn't oh i hate this one i hate this one i accidentally opened one in my house because oh look 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 right our unknown what the heck rude where was that where was that oh no that could have been a slime pet. Where was it? Oh my gosh, I have to find it now. Was it? Was that a chest? It was a chest, wasn't it? These guys have weird names. Okay, where was it? I was was. Oh, here it is. Heart pet. I don't know what that does. Die, weirdo. Okay. Well, I guess they do spawn. I think it's just harder to find them in here because... Actually, wait. I want to get some cocoa beans while I'm here. Cocoa beans. Because I think they're hard to find. Because I feel like I'm going to... I think if I remember correctly. Reading, reading one of the wikis. I'm going to need them. I only need like one. There we go. That has an exchange value, right? Yep. Okay. Pandora's box number two. Let's me come over here. It's nicely lit over here. Because of these candy sprinkles and fake sugar. Wait, open! I always forget that, like, you have to. Oh, well, at least it spawned me a bunch of glass to, sand to stand on. That was very nice of it. You know, like, it could have just spawned. A whole lot of lava and let me die but at least it spawned me a nice little platform to stand on here we go wonder what this one's gonna do nothing sometimes they oh wait no I did something I did something what I don't want any of that I literally don't want any of that here we go What is the sword? Is this a good... No, I don't want that. I have a big Bertha. And you're trying to give me a sharpness 2 diamond sword? Are you crazy? What the heck? Oh, I don't like this one. Ugh, I don't like being trapped. Oh, wait, there's a hole. Okay, it, it spawned me a little hole to get out of. I'll just put this one down right here. Actually, let's put down two. What is it going to get? Ah! Oh my gosh, so rude. So incredibly rude. I was about to drown. Wait, what did the other one do? Did it just like not even spawn because of all the water? Probably. Oh wait, there's the the stuff from the other one. It was the Wait, where's the exit? How do I get out? It was the the one that that rained cows and and they all die because you know, fall damage. Oh, this is annoying. Actually, this is kind of good. I, I need... Actually, no, I don't. I don't need string. I have everything I could ever want out of my transmutation table. I don't need string. Got four of it, though. 
Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. It's so magical. Oh look. What is this one doing? What is this? Is it pixel art? Or is it just giant blobs of color? Oh look. It's a nice little rainbow. Hello everyone, so I did the thing where I record like an hour at a time and then I go to edit it and I'm like, oh, this is an hour. I can't post that because it'll take too long to upload, so I better cut it in half. So, that's gonna be it for today's episode. Tomorrow, we're going to open the rest of those Pandora's boxes and then open some random dungeon spawners. I really need to start keeping a timer on me when I'm doing these episodes because I've done this way too many times. So anyways, I'll see you guys next time. If you leave a nice comment or a helpful tip, be sure to leave your IGN in the comments so I can add you to my little hallway. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!